Uber, one of the world's largest ride-sharing platforms, became a publicly traded company in 2019 and posted $1.1 billion in net income for the year of 2021. Uber was in the news again two weeks ago, not for record profits, but for another network breach. Yes, I said another network breach. In 2016, Uber was hacked and the personal information for over 57 million drivers and passengers was stolen. Then Chief Security Officer Joseph Sullivan is currently on trial for secretly trying to pay the hackers $100,000 to keep the breach secret as Uber courted investors. Uber did learn from the 2016 breach when stolen credentials, usernames, and passwords were used to gain access. Uber implemented multi-factor or two-factor authentication. Like the name implies, two-factor requires more than just a username and a password to log into corporate systems. Some two-factor systems send text messages, and some require the user to accept a login using a mobile application and pop-up messages. Uber chose the latter system, but even that could not save them from a group of dedicated teenage hackers. The teenager began sending multiple messages to users until someone at Uber finally clicked OK. The digital equivalent of mom, mom, mom. Mom, mom, members of the Lapsus dollar sign group prove that you can annoy your way even into a billion dollar company's network. The scope of the breach is still unknown. Experts believe the teens were able to access every system on the Uber network.